So my pockets that we repaired on these pants, well, the pocket that we repaired on the pants ripped this week, but not on my repaired side, it was on the other side. So then I put my phone in the left pocket so that it wouldn't fall through the right pocket and then the left pocket tore. So now we're making we new pockets First. Yeah, so you want to cut the pocket out, and so now we're making new pockets out of old shirts. But you wanted it longer. But we wanted a slightly bigger pocket, so we're making it slightly bigger. We'll see if it works. We got ourselves some early Christmas presents, as well as my mom helping us on our Christmas presents. So we got some new boots, some Danner boots. These are Giovanna's. And these are mine. Okay, then I'm gonna tighten this up. I was gonna look to see where you're. I gotta pull my gear. I think that should be good. It gets a bit of your helmet in it. This year it'll be bigger gloves. I'll tell you that much. Freaking A. Just putting on sucks. Freaking lodge. I know. That's like who's playing the piano. (laughs) 
we are in the vehicle for lunch and I may have slightly strained an intercostal muscle on one of my ribs. I took a little bit off the beaten path trail into the trees. On purpose. I mean, it was on purpose, obviously. Well, I mean, if you lost control. And no, you... no. <laughs> Went into the tree line that someone made on purpose, then it, then it kept going up and up higher into this, the mountainside, and there, the, the main run was down below. Well, eventually the, the trail ran out after jumping over a couple logs, well, skimming over them. And uh, so then I had to shimmy all the way down on my butt down back to the bottom of the run, except when I entered the bottom of the run, then I totally wiped out, and I, I think I kind of strained one of those one of those rib muscles a little bit. It's definitely not a bruised rib though, because those hurt more, so it's okay though. But so far, it's a really good day. We're going to start pulling everyone over that goes- I wasn't recording that whole time. We are at the Festival of Trees, which is, I'll turn the camera around in a second, a uh, exhibit of Christmas trees, wreaths, nativities, things like that, and everyone donates it, and then the, it's a silent auction, then all the proceeds go to a children's hospital for paying for things they can't pay for. And uh, yeah, parking was terrible, but lucked out and got a spot right in front. Mm -hmm. And it is really, really busy. Giovanna got hungry, so we had to get a pretzel and some nachos. <laughs> the uh, movie with the girl that had us. dropping ice, dropping salt and clearing slush. Um, and this guy at the very end, when we were, how do you explain it? So when we were coming along, there was an exit that just joined, creating the third lane. And he perfectly aligned himself with it. It was so impressive. It was crazy. Killing wanted to video. But they block, um, apparently they block the entire canyon road, it looks like. And yeah. Clear it in one big swath like this. Yeah. So. so it's super nice, it's super convenient. And I mean, they have those cool green glow sticks.